What's up everybody welcome to the channel okay bitcoin has had this uh, big pump at the moment uh it went up to 21883.4 and this is what i was waiting for if we take the fibonacci retracement from the peak here at 25.2 to the bottom here at 18.5 exactly almost exactly to the dollar i mean it's probably 33 dollars 0.4 from the 0.5 fib and we're getting a reaction why the 0.5 fib the 0.5 fib is a is a good retracement for a wave two in elliott wave count if we consider this move down from 25.2 to 18.5 as one big wave one with the five wave structure as a one two three four and five and now we're going up for a correction in a wave two we could have this wave two over however we could go up and hit that green trend line that i was showing you in my other video before at around 22k uh let me just uh, go to the four hourly chart there we go this is the four hourly we have some levels to watch for and some of my charts we have this level the pink this pink line is just where we sold off from 21886 last time last week and now we're back there again are we going to sell off again or are we going to pump up if we pump up i think if we come up to here this is on the four hourly 22180 we could have a good rejection however we could still rip up if we rip up then we'll be coming up to that 23628k range what to watch out for at the moment and what are the possibilities if we get a rejection from here and we consider this as the end of the correction or possibly just the end of one wave up as a correction then we're going to have a wave two down i mean an a then a b then we're going to have a c then we're going to come up for a big wave three down then our retracement essentially we know bitcoin loves the fib level so if we go and put this fibonacci retracement and we take a look our 0.618 lies exactly at 19779.6 this is on binance we have other levels to watch for 2188 21088 and the 20587 and the 0.5 at 20,183. However, Bitcoin loves its golden pocket. It might come as low as 19,779. I think we might come down as 20,045 when we pull back. I'm not saying we're going to pull back right now immediately. However, we had some bearish div on the two hourly, on our money flow index, and on the RSI developing. So this could be, I think it was, I believe it was hidden bearish divergence. This could be it playing out let's not get excited we might still have another pump up just be aware that there is a possibility that this is a rejection point we are at the 0.5 fib we are at the level where we sold off last week from uh 20 around 21 a 22k so we are there again again this was to be exact we sold off at this level we hit this level on the 26th of august and we hit it before that on the 24th of August. So we hit it on 24th and on 26th, then we continued down. So we could have another spike up, but this is a high. I think for a person who wants to go short, this is possibly a good probability trade, your risk to reward ratio. You could have, I would have my stop loss slightly higher, probably depending on the ATR, as I use the ATR to decide on my stop loss, probably at uh, around, uh, 22k if i go in now sorry atr on the hourly the atr is 153 so 153 points up wouldn't be a bad point or even double it 300 points up from here would be 21.9 so possibly somewhere around above that wick so yeah uh if you like the content and you enjoyed it uh, smash the